Australia recorded its first homegrown rocket launch, Eris Rocket, attempting to reach orbit from the country's soil, from northern Queensland on Wednesday morning local time, but failed and crashed. Video widely circulated online, showed the rocket in the air for less than 14 seconds, and crashing shortly after liftoff, surviving about 23 seconds of engine burn. It was somewhat frightening, that it was the first rocket test in the history of the Australian rocket industry, designed to carry small satellites into orbit, and launched by Gold Coast-based Gilmore Space Technologies. However, the rocket unexpectedly crashed and returned to Earth in a fireball, during the test flight from a spaceport near the small town of Bowen. Spectators gathered in Bowen reported hearing an explosion and seeing a thick plume of smoke during the launch and moments afterward. It looked like a total failure, but the team behind Australian first homegrown rocket claims the launch wasn't a failure at all, as the rocket still made it into the air. The manufacturer nonetheless hailed the flight as a huge step for Australia entry into the global space industry, and it remains a significant milestone for the country's space ambitions. Developer Gilmore Space Technologies noted that the rocket successfully lifted off marking a significant step forward for Australian space capabilities. Co-founder Adam Gilmore posted on social media that the company was pleased with the launch attempt. Off the pad, I'm happy, he wrote.